first problem is what is the exact number of bits in a memory that contain 48k bits, 384 millibits, and 8 gigabits. In solving for this, we're just going to start with a first. 1k we know to be equal to 1000. However, with bits, it's not just 1000. When we're doing dealing with bits, we always have base 2. So we have to have something up here, some exponent, that will get it to be equal to or greater than 1000. So to do this, we can just test values, but the value that is just greater than 1000 or 1k is going to be 10. So we're going to have 2 to the 10th, and this is a little bit greater than 1000. This is going to be 1024. So that is 1k bits. So to solve for a, we're basically just going to have 48 times 1024. And this is going to give us 49,152 bits. So that is the answer to the first one. Now for the second one, for part B, we have 384 millibits. So this is like a million. We'll have our 384 out here times. And we need to do the same thing that we did up here, just right here. So 1m is equal to 1 million. So we'll write this out like this. So when we solve for our base 2, it's going to be 2 to some exponent that has to be greater than or equal to 1 million. Well, the exponent for this is 2 to the 20. And this is going to give us 1048576. So we're just going to multiply this 384 by that value. And this is going to give us 402,653,184 bits. For the last one, we have 8 gigabits. So we're going to have 8 times, and then we're going to find out what we're multiplying by. 1 gig is basically 1 billion. So it's going to be written like this. So our 2 to some exponent has to be greater than our 1 gig. And the exponent for that is going to be 2 to the 30. 2 to the 30 is just going to be 1073741824. And it's going to give us 8,589,934,592 bits.